New information tonight in the nail salon arson plot that we broke this afternoon. A Butler County nail salon owner accused of trying to burn down a competitor's salon and prosecutors say she enlisted the help of two other women to do it. Local 12's Luke Jones is live outside the federal courthouse. Luke. And this all happened more than a week ago, but a grand jury met here today and indicted all three women. Now, these are very serious allegations, but tonight we're no closer to learning a possible motive. At Love Nails and Spa in Westchester, there was no love for our camera. Employees quickly dropping a curtain after we showed up with questions about the owner, a woman named Kim Vu. A federal grand jury just indicted her and two other women for trying to burn down this Monroe salon. The alleged plot came together over the course of a week. The two other women, Sierra Bishop and Michaela Rennick, posed as customers and made a pedicure appointment at Bora Bora Nails and Spa on February 5th. While they were in there, prosecutors say they left a bag under one of the desks. Employees discovered it and walked it out here to this dumpster where it promptly caught on fire. Inside that bag, some sort of device which employees say smelled like gasoline. They tell investigators it looked like an explosive device. Can I speak with Kim about this indictment? A woman at Vu's home turned and walked away. What's the beef with Bora Bora? Declining to shed light on a possible motive. But prosecutors say there's no glossing over it. People could have died that day. And here's another plot twist in all of this. Those two women, when they were setting up their appointment, one's accused of using the fake name Caitlin in a bid to, quote, sound white. We've also learned Vu, the alleged mastermind here, is a registered nurse. Live downtown, Luke Jones, Local 12 News. Luke, thank you. All three women were released from jail on their own recognizance. Now, because this is a federal case, we don't have mug shots for any of them.